What's to Ish Meters here? And uh, as you can see, um, as you can see, well, before we start this video, I wanted to, to let you know, like the video if you enjoy, and subscribe to join the Spam Squad today. And we do it another story time Saturday. Hey. Um, but with that being said, um, I just wanted to explain what I was doing while I was gone. So this is less of a, this is less of a, well, yeah, no, it's still a story, kind of. It's more of an update. It's not like a past story. Um, so I have a cousin who is in the, uh, is in the Air Force. Well, he's like starting you know how like army has a college and air force has a college well he's in air force college right so he came home for break or came home for a break and his mom asked what did he want wanted to do, do and he said he wanted to go to the beach and the closest well, well the closest non cold beach well not really cold the closest beach that he wanted to go to out of all the beaches closest Closer to him, he wanted to come to the one that's about two hours away from my house, which is about eight hours away from them. Eight or six, I can't remember. Uh, so he decided he wanted to go to that, that beach. So I was like, so my mom was like, yeah, we'll go. And we'll, um, day one, when they when they arrived, all we did was stay here at my house and we just played MLB the show. And they changed my, or they told me what hitting settings is, is the best hitting settings. So then, that's why that video that I uploaded of me playing in the road to show didn't have a voiceover, and the reason why my hitting settings changed. Because they gave me some new hitting settings. So I was like, I'm gonna play a road to the show game and see if it ends my streak. Um, now, it did end up, it did end up ending my streak, which is great. But... Day two, we spent that day traveling, and then once we got there, we went to the beach, and then we went to the pool. We left early in the morning, so we could just chill out for that day. Uh, so, we, um, we left really early so we could make it, and, you know, not just, like, go straight to the hotel room. Um, so we stayed at the beach in the pool for that day, and then, what, uh, second day? The second day... Um, me and, uh, my, well, so the, the, my cousin, they have, they have six kids, right? They have six kids in total. So the one that's my age, like literally my age, about to go to senior year and everything. Um, we decided we were going to let, um, the oldest one which is the one coming from Air Force College, and his girlfriend have a day by themselves. So we went on a walk, and we just walked, like, all the way. We walked all the way across the entire, like, beach strip. We, even, we walked into a total, a total different town, and then got something to eat, and then came back. We walked, walked like, like, I think he said seven miles, or not seven miles, four miles there and back. Four mile, miles there. So eight miles back. Yeah, that's what it was. So the beach strip really wasn't that long. Because the beach isn't that well, at least the tourist part of the beach wasn't that long. Because we were kind of in, where our hotel was, it was kind of in the middle. So, it was kind of like, we just walked half, not the full strip. So, it really would have been, what, 16, because it's about, yeah, that's about right. I think it's about 25, actually. So we walked close to um, but, uh, um, so then at the end of that day, when we walked back, we got like ice cream and stuff, um, on the way back, on the way back, the oldest cousin called me and said, we're going to go, uh, mini golfing and go-kart, um, racing. So we ended up meeting up with them. We ended up meeting up with them and going go kart racing. Okay, hold on. I gotta get rid of this last one. Let's get the Okay, so 
Nice pistol. Okay. Um. Now. With um, we went go kart racing. We went to this one go kart place, and they charged us a hundred dollars. But we also had had five people, so it was like it would have been like twenty dollars for one person. But because we had so many people, it was mad expensive. And then we had a basketball tournament, and I lost in the finals, and I'm upset. I lost by like three points in the finals. I'm so not like a basketball, like an actual like basketball tournament. You know those little shoot, um, like hop a shot games and um arcades. We played those, and I lost in the finals by three points. And yeah. I also broke the high score on my on the the machine that I was playing on in the first round. So like mobs were mad tight. I, I should have looked over and saw what everyone else had and then just quit shooting. Whenever I realized I was too high for them, but I started before them, so I didn't want to have somebody hit too many threes and then come back and beat me. Okay. Now that day was finished. We didn't even. I don't think we went to. We might have went to the pool. Um, I'm not certain. I don't remember going to the pool. Oh, we did. We did. We went to the pool and we played tag and got kicked out. <laughs> played tag in the lazy river and we got kicked out. It was hilarious. Because a lot of those kids are like really young. Uh, like nine. Well, there's another 14 year old. I think the oldest is like nine. Other than him. Nine. So it's it's what 18 it was 18 17 16 16 14 9 and then everyone was we had like a bunch of kids too. Okay. Now after that day um, we kind of, we had one more day in our separate room, and then the, the, ne the next day was, um, spent in the all-together room. Um, so we spent our final day in our room. I don't even remember what we did. Yeah, I don't. I think we just went swimming. I believe we did. It, I don't, we didn't do anything special this day. Um, gonna say that oh no um actually the day we went go-karting was our last night there so we had a we had to get out of that room at 10 so we so that's what we spent the morning doing and anyone who knows me knows i do not get up i don't i am not the morning person so i got up uh went down to the other room at 10 or like 7 we went to actually we went to breakfast with my grandmother at six o'clock in the morning. Um, yeah, so we went to breakfast with my grandmother at six o'clock in the morning, and then after that, I went down to that room and just sat there and slept for like four hours, and then got up and went to the pool, and we spent the rest of the day at the pool. But I missed something yesterday. Yesterday after the pool, after we played tag, we were mad hungry, right? Because, like, why would you not be? You just swam around the pool for, like, what felt like eight hours, right? So we went to, so, my, it was, like, 11 o'clock, you know, like, one of the only things that's open at 11 o'clock is, like, Waffle House. My cousin ain't been to Waffle House. So we decided to go to Waffle House, right? The only person there was my drunk mom, his drunk mom, my well, my drunk aunt, and my drunk grandmother. So we decided to take my drunk grandmother, and boy, she was acting a fool, but that's a story for another day. Probably next week, uh, unless I can think of another story. But, um, yeah, that's another, that's a different story. That's probably the reason why I missed it, because I was, you know, didn't want to reveal too much. Um, but on the last day, I kind of just went to the pool and sat in the hot tub for like 19 hours. And then we left, and we went shop. We did not go shopping. We got food. Everyone got what they wanted the last day. Some people wanted fish. Some people wanted Panda Express. I was one of the people who wanted Panda Express. I did not like fish. 
Uh, some people got pizza as well, which I thought was strange. Um, now, um, on the ooh, on the last day, um, shoot. When we officially left, the littlest one, the youngest one, she wanted to get a pet, or she wanted to get a souvenir, and she didn't have a souvenir. And every single sign that you pass at the beach, it's like, oh, we'll give you a free hermit crab with the, with the, uh, if you buy a uh, cage, right? So she said, I want a hermit crab. So they ended up buying a freaking massive hermit crab. And I kid you not, that hermit crab was freaking huge. And I feel bad for the parents. Is this the same guy? This is the same guy I fought earlier. Hold on, I'm not. I'm not playing it. So. I already. Fought. No, I did not mean to hit rejoin. I'm not fighting against him. Again. Uh, my bad, y'all. Um, now when they got the hermit crab, the hermit crab was freaking massive, and I believe its name is Rocky after Rocky Balboa, which boy oh boy is that hilarious. Um. Her and my aunt named it, cause not not her mom, but my other aunt, cause we had a lot of people there. I think we had like 15 people in total. So 15, 13, 14, I don't know. But um, after we got the hermit crab, we just we just went home, and uh, we talked about our reason, or me and my. Me and the cousin that was my age, we talked about the reasons why we, we went on this trip. Because I wasn't supposed to go. I was not supposed to go at all. Oh, he disconnected. Great. Um, I was not supposed to go. I was supposed to stay at home and... Did he disconnect or is he still here? I'm confused. Um... What am I doing? Uh... So we decided, or no, the the fourteen year old, right? He's used to chilling with me at all times. So um, when I heard that the oldest, his girlfriend was coming, I was like, Nah, he's not gonna have nobody to chill with because he's because uh, the oldest one was gonna chill with his girlfriend, which he did, right? So I decided to come because of him. And the cousin that's my age decided to come because of me. <laughs> so we basically had a cycle of, oh, I'm going, so he's going to go now type thing. It was strange. Um, now, after after we arrived at the house, because well, we were talking about that on the way home. After we arrived at the house, they decided that they were going to go to Carolyn's the next day. Not Kara. Uh, yeah, they were gonna go to Kara's the next day, um, which is an amusement park. If you don't know. And I said, no, I'm not gonna go. So that's why I'm here recording now because what I spent that what I spent this this entire day doing was pre-recording about a month's worth of footage, and then I realized that Madden 20 comes out on or Madden 20 comes out on August 2nd. So I stopped recording. Um, I didn't record any mutt drafts, but I'm probably gonna re probably gonna record at least one more, just because I don't think because it takes me forever to download games. Jesus Christ! No, not playing this. Nope, not doing it. Nope, nope, nope. But um, but uh, it takes me forever to download games, so I'm just not even gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna record one more. And then the next week it'll be only Madden 20. So with that being said, um, everyone was mad at me that I didn't go to Kiramas because you know, people be people be aggravating. Um, everyone was extremely mad at me for nothing. Um, and then they left the trip. Everybody left mad at me. So. Everyone's kind of... My grandmother's still mad at me. Uh, I just didn't want to go to Carolyn. But, uh... 
Um, with that being said, I like to give shout outs to the boys at the end of these. Um, shout out to SMTD Eclipse, who is literally waiting for me to join his party right now. So I gotta hurry up and record this video. Um, uh, shout out to SMTD Fate, the God Tier Editor. Um, shout out to SMTD Elite, our montage editor. I haven't talked to him in a while. Um, and then we have the SMTD Clan channel. Which we don't know about that anymore. Shout out to the, um, shout out to the, uh, what? Shoot, I completely forgot. Shout out to the Clan Insta and Clan, um, Twitter, which we should upload on those, but we don't. I don't even remember the password. Um, and then shout out to the. Uh... Oh wait, that's all the shout outs. <laughs> but uh, like I said in the beginning of the video, uh, like the video if you enjoyed, and if you did enjoy, subscribe to join the spam squad today. And, uh, Jesus, okay, hold on, we gotta win this match, we can't end on a loss, that's a Koji, oh jeez, why does he look like a freaking Power Ranger, hold on, yo, we're not out until the end of this match anyway, but, okay, Koji's, Koji, calm down, you know, this is my worst legend, well, not my worst, like, Okay, Kaya is my best legend. I'm talking about Koji. Koji isn't the worst legend for me to play. I cannot play. Kojis are usually really, really sweaty. That's why I can't play. Did I get a kill off of BM? Because I'm almost certain I did not. Well, no, I didn't. Up sig with uh, Wu Chang. Grab him. Please kill. That's not gonna kill. Freak. I know I can win with Zario. I don't care who is who who his last guy is, I can win with Zario. Come on. I just gotta get this kill. Let's go! That's he's gone. Yes. Let's go. Who's that? Ninx? Oh jeez, that's Ninx. Alright. Alright boys. Alright boys, we're gonna have to slap him. Okay. He's probably decent with sight. I learned, oh wait, I need to tell um, Andrew this, but I learned that I can gravity cancel on the last one and throw up my little elephant, this right here, and it'll connect, but I just can't do it yet, I ain't done it yet, somebody did it on me, got him, let's go, that's a GG, and uh, with that being said, oh, what, that hit me, with that being said, I, I nope, not um, I'm, oh, I thought that hit it. That'd be a sad. Hello? No. No! No, 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 no. I don't even want to go to Zario now. I'm out. Peace out!